Hi, I'm Shirley Williams, and this is Instrumental. I always wanted to be an artist. I moved to Windsor in 1991 from Toronto, where I was a documentary film producer. I've been an artist for, oh, I guess about 25 years now. I started to get really interested in paper and old vintage books that I was finding at flea markets and embedding it into my canvases. And before doing that, I would paint them or um, transfer uh, paint to the papers themselves. And then someone came along and showed me this silicone thing, which is fabulous. It's called um, a jelly plate. And it's made out of, I don't know, silicone and mineral oil. But what makes this different is that, first of all, it's very transportable. It's not like having a, an etching press or anything like that. I can layer very, very quickly. Acrylic paints, they don't dry. They have a very long open time on this because of the silicone nature. And I can press any kind of paper on it and create unique textures uh, that are unique to me as well. So basically it's mixed media as opposed to just painting, which is what I did for many years. And when you start on a canvas or a piece of paper, it's white. It has no personality or anything. And to activate the surface and make it interesting to begin and to, to, to make it a pathway into the creative process of painting or collaging, um, it, it becomes um, a sort of a challenge. You put something down and then you react to it. So it's a call and response. Whereas I find with just paint now, um, I've kind of gotten bored with it. I'm finding there are so many medias now that are uh, mediums, I suppose, that are compatible. So for example, charcoal, um, oil pastels, I use them all, um, inks, uh, acrylic paints, I scrape it on, I scrape it off, I sand it on, I sand it off. And the, the excitement of the collage embedded in there somewhere is that as you scrape it off and as you sand it off, colors and bits of paper will come through or bits of writing or letters, which uh, gives kind of a history, um, an embedded history that has more meaning to the viewer because it's not just flat paint, which was always the case before. This, this whole process has completely changed my way of thinking in, as an artist and has given me inspiration for a whole new body of work. I'm so thrilled. I'm getting them in every size, as you can see, a six inch disc and a four by four. And um, to create all kinds of things, I'm just experimenting at this time. So I'm really not sure where I'm going, but I do know it's really exciting.